Hello, Creative Vision here, and I will be showing you a tutorial how to rig your characters so you can animate them. So, as you can see, I just have a normal, not that great model that I made by myself. And as you can see, it's just a, a cube. I used a cube and I like stretched out the stuff and everything. So, I'll just call this. Uh, model. Um, I'm not going to be showing you a modeling tutorial right now because it will take too long so I might make it later but this is just for character rigging. So um, you have to change the view into front and okay there was random music playing and change the display to grout shading however it is pronounced I call it grout shading whatever um next thing you need to do is uh, go to character and use the joint tool make sure nothing is selected right now uh, then what you have to do is uh, on a Mac you have to hold control and on PC you I mean on Mac you would have to hold command I think let's take a look yeah on Mac you would have to hold command and on Windows you would have to hold control so uh, let me teach you something fast right now uh, since uh, if you're gonna make it so it's gonna move don't start with like a leg and don't start in the middle start it where there's gonna be no motion which is pretty much over here so click command and click here and as you can see it made one joint and if you can see there's a little like orangey yellow square here and just uh, keep holding control and clicking and here uh, as you can see it's like in the middle of the arms and then go to where the neck is the bottom of the neck the top of the neck uh, and the top of the head so uh, we have like uh, if I go to display like skeleton this is their skeleton right now so like, let's go why sure and hidden lines as you can see it's kind of not that straight but it's okay for me uh, for me it doesn't really matter uh, so now what you have to do is you have to make the arms so choose the joint which is in the middle which is this joint and you would have to go into uh, object I think no. I'm still in the joint tool right yeah uh, um, now uncheck the root null and in symmetry choose uh, draw pretty sure it's draw uh, so now I don't think now you still need to hold, yeah you still need to hold control so, um, choose the place where you're going to put the joint. Make sure the middle is selected. And as you can see, I would place it here. And then where the elbow is. And the end of the hand. And then do the same thing for the legs. Choose that thing and make it here. Because this is where the bending is going to start and the knees and the end of the feet so if you take a look at our model right now he has a skeleton so this is uh... what we have right now but as you can see um, okay this is better um, if we take uh, like a hand. Let's take a look. And I suggest you name them later. Oh, and rotate it. Nothing will happen. Uh, so what you have to do is select a root, and then select uh, uh, right click it, and click select children. One second, where's that? Um, select children, and then select your model. and go into character commands bind 
and now you won't see any difference right now but it is connected so if you choose like this and you rotate it it's gonna rotate the hand so now you can animate it pretty much and like let's, let's choose this as you can see there you go you can animate your character now I'm actually wondering if I can like stretch that. Whoa, I can stretch it out. Okay. Uh, so, uh, this is pretty much the basic thing. And one second, there was a tool. Uh, it's weight tool. Um, so you can see how much it will bend. Uh, so if you like, as when you if you saw, it bent too much of. Uh, one second, I wanna. I want to choose the colors. Uh, make this like black or something, so it'll be more visible. Oh, I know this is just. Never mind. Um, display. Okay. Okay, sure. Um, let's take a look. Maybe. Okay, that's much better. And see, it would bend this much, and I didn't want it, so I just uh, erase this. So I would suggest you do that, uh, just so it won't like mess up your uh, model a lot uh, when like the hand moves and everything. So one second, I just need to show you what it what it's gonna look like. I think my computer is a bit slow because it's exporting out some project that I'm working on. And while I'm doing this, if you click on my ad, if you click on the ads next to my videos, it helps me a lot. So if you'd be so kind to click on them, I would be very happy. <laughs> just saying, you know, don't need to. You don't necessarily have to do that. Just it would be good. Okay, let's take a look. Almost done. Okay. So now, if you see, if when we rotate it, it doesn't mess up like the other parts of the body. But as you can see, it's it's also not a hundred percent perfect. But that's just because I didn't put too much work into actually doing that. So as you can see, you can animate the models now. So, um, and I would like to see how far you got with this. So if you leave a uh, um, video response, that would be great because then I'm going to see how good you guys are because I'm pretty sure you're going to be better than me because my models are just horrible. So yeah, thank you. Please subscribe, like, comment, and rate, and favorite and suggest to your friends, and eat some chocolate. So, thank you, and goodbye.